All right, hello everyone. This is the fanboys of Discontent. Limited edition playthrough with Arkin and Soviet Sasquatch. Yay, I provide snark. Yay, all the snark. This is like what me watching a Let's Play. Except it's the person <laughs> in you live. Can talk at it. Yes. Oh, it's not going to hold my hand. What a dick. How are you how are you supposed to you hold, have a relationship with the game if it won't hold your hand? Who I was. When the police won't help you and the priests don't believe you, you call on Paul Prospero. You call on me. To be fair, a kid like priests Ethan, of Dagon don't really right. give a fuck. It's not what that they don't believe you. Ethan's <laughs> out just like I don't know why that automatically popped in my head. It's That's not like we've been talking about Dagon like all afternoon. Any boy should know about. There are places that exist that very <laughs> few people can see. That's yeah, true. Ethan. What, what if he gets? What if he legitimately <laughs> gets captured by deep ones? Yet, but already I could feel like darkness reaching What if? Me. What if that's literally Someone what happened? Carter wasn't going to be as easy. As I mean, dude's name story. is Ethan Carter. He could be a descendant of Randolph Carter. To find Ethan. Which one is Randolph Carter? He was uh, pretty much Lovecraft's avatar. For me. He went everywhere, oh, did all the things. Yeah. Yeah. Cool cat. Cool cat. So I turned off head bob because fuck that shit. Let's go. There's a little path. A path, path. Oh, fuck <laughs> me. Wow. Um, um. Sense. <laughs> sense what? What is that doing for me? I don't... Oh, can you move it at all? Mm. It does look like it's kind of moving around the screen a little bit, like... Can you go film no or... What was that game? I don't know. LA Noir. Yeah. I can't... I'm pushing the left stick. Okay. It's I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. This is a let's figure out this game thing. You tried the touchpad? I have not yet. I keep forgetting that to Damn. Nope. What is it? Nope. Alright. Okay. I don't I don't know. Ah! You missed! <laughs> Yeah. Thank God that missed. What if I died in the first fucking 15 seconds of the game? Okay. There's some moss on that log. Jeez, this is another trap, really? Oh, as I find the traps, I gain more pieces. Oh, okay. Oh man, there's gonna be a lot of traps in these woods. Um, Ooh. another one. It's leading me to a certain place or a certain marker. Okay. Just another trap. Are you a trap? Are you the jackal? <laughs> um, there's light on this patch. Is it a trap? <laughs> there's the tracks. That's one that I'll never be able to understand. What? The light traps, like... Just, I cover up the light. And somehow, the trap's like, oh, I've sensed that. I see you, whack! I mean, seriously, that, that should mean that that thing should activate just because it became night. Or overhead clouds. Oh, all that's right. all I would take. Your trap went off. Why? Because you had tied it to the sun, dipshit. You activated my trap card. <laughs> it was the sun. <laughs> <laughs> Is this a trap? Where's Admiral Akbar when you need him? <laughs> oh, she is. It's dark. Is this a trap? Can you press X and see if it bring? Ah, oh, it doesn't bring up the thing. Hmm. Sorry, that was awful of me. 
Are these rocks a trap? Um, okay. Like, I get the find all the things kind of info. It's funny. We weren't looking for traps. We found them. Hey! Oh, look. It's a trap. Oh, still got a piece missing. Still missing one piece? Okay. The metal piece? Okay. The skyline of a cliff. Okay, so there's one trap. Yeah. There's another trap. Okay, but so, actually, go back to the trap a second. It looks okay. like that tree line right behind it is what you want to look at. Yeah, okay. So you need the elm and then... Okay. If you look, yeah. See, it's, it's, it looks kind of like... Where I'm at over, right now? Over, eh, a little bit over. You're looking... You need like a sand rocks on the cliff. Not oh. not like big boulders, but tiny, tiny rocks. Okay. I feel like if I walk this way, I should run into something else. Well, you, and you weren't you uh, left the train tracks as well. There could be a trap on that. You think? Not possibly. Why would there be a oh, trap? There's that dude. Hi, oh, buddy. I almost stepped on Oh, I have to go in front of it. You must go in front of the uh, tetanus nails to get your shot. Oh. You gotta stop summoning Yogg. That's, <laughs> that's a bad idea. I feel like I just got hit by a Yithian and I just got, like, thrown into another dimension and now I'm here. So there's nothing... Okay, so there's something special about this place. I think it's just the next area. It was just pointing you in a, in the direction. See, this kind of has a... There's bones. Oh. Th this is no bueno. <laughs> this is not good, Soviet. These are awesome little Jerry's. People got murdered here. Ah, it's just Jerry. It's a field... This is a graveyard. Of Jerry. Of Jerry. Why of Jerry? I don't know. Jerry's a good name. I'd have a, I would have a graveyard of Jerry's. I'm going to make a bad pun. Was he a geriatric? Yeah. Uh, you want me to go geriatric? No. No, please don't. Okay, we got to zoom. An old man came to the forest every day to drink sap from the tree. To get there, the old man had to step around many dangerous traps. The villagers believed this old man... Must have hidden... Must have hidden a jade amulet in the forest, but the old man wanted the villagers to believe this because then they wouldn't search the forest for treasure or not drink his sap. Oh, they would search the treasure for treasure. One cool fall night, someone set fire to the forest and the fire spread to the village. The old man escaped the fire by covering himself in sap. When he returned Can you, uh... to... When he returned to the villagers' homes... The old man sat down and cried, sat down and, and he cried. found more sap to drink. Well, that's the way I, you know, I, that, that's a good coping method. I, I just goodness. figured it out. Oh. We didn't have to read that that way. We're awesome. Yeah, we we suffered. We suffered for you. Ethan, I told you, you can't be here. But Who's Brad, Ed? I wrote something oh. for you. That's real nice. Thank you. Just, just leave it. I'll read it later. <laughs> okay. Mm. Sap. And there's a bottle right there. And that delicious, delicious... We just write a bunch of sap. Eldritch sap. <laughs> Fresh from still? the fount of horrors. Oh, here's another one. Oh, we're in a different... <gasps> it changed! Yeah! It changed! Like, even this over here is different. Ooh, game. They took our Jerry's! They took our Jerry's. I want my Jerry's back. <laughs> you gotta find my Jerry's. One dead in house fire by Jeff Jerkface. Gayfield <laughs> County. <laughs> fire damaged a historic home in Red Creek Valley Wednesday morning, according to officials from the Bayfield County Fire Department. A family of six was asleep when the blaze broke out at the remote house, once out by Albert 
Van, Van de Griff. De Griff. At... 46 Old Ogden Road in Red Creek Valley, Gales Carter, 58, was pronounced dead at the scene. Gail Carter, not Gales. <laughs> Jesus. Remaining family members were able to escape. Carter's husband, Ed- Edwin, 62, told investigators he m- may have fallen asleep with a lit cigarette in his hand. Oh, it was his grandma. It was Ethan's grandma. Firefighters were dispatched to the scene at 4.22 a.m. and remained at the scene until around 5 a.m. Wednesday. They returned to the property four hours later to extinguish hot spots, which had rekindled. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Way to go, Ed. Sure. You lit the house on fire. No. Nope. Was that murder? I don't believe so. Are you calling it murder? No, I'm, belie- I, I'm thinking that uh, old Gail there had some kind of demonic, demonic entity and he had to burn her down because of the... Things that mankind was not supposed to know. Okay. And they took our Jerry's, damn it. They took our Jerry's. <laughs> it didn't change this time. So we have the two red notes. There must be. Follow the pathway I'm... down. Do I want to? Can I? Oh. No, I can't. Oh. Oh God. Sorry. Back to the rails, bunch. It's oh. railroading us. Feel the story railroad you. Why? <laughs> I did not want Anikage on this so the puns would end. You made it worse. I only do one. Y- yeah, just the, just the one. I could have said I only do pun. Mm. Yep. Yep. To be fair, yours are better than Brandon's. His are fantastic and painful. <laughs> They're so painful. That's why I have a beat stick in this house. <laughs> For Brandon's puns. <laughs> It's his punishment. <laughs> okay. So there is a tree here. And a tree there. And rocks. Okay, there's just, it's just like sunlight. Moves. Yeah. Yeah. There's still a little bit of bob. But. Yeah. I think that's just the thing. It's more like a jive bob. Like, yeah. Yeah, I'm smooth. Just Lake bobbing. Valley. It seemed like a quiet, ordinary place. But it's I've not. i two things in my life. No place is truly quiet. Well. And nowhere is really ordinary. Ethan warned me about that. Warned me not to be fooled by what I saw here. He didn't need to worry. I'd worked dozens of cases. Hundreds. This would be my last one. Oh, Already, I mean. oh dude. <laughs> this is like, um... Two days show. until retirement, eh? <laughs> this, this is like the show that I was watching on Netflix, The Killing, mm. where she said she'll never be obsessed with a case again because she was obsessed with a case about a little girl. And now she's, like, obsessed about this new case, like, solving it because her partner's an idiot. So it's, it's kind of like that. It's like, but she's like, this will be my last case. This will be my last day. And then she stays. Look. Look. What? What am I standing on? Where are my legs? Oh, your legs Where are, did they go? Your legs aren't important. Watch, I'm going to get hit by a train. Blood. Okay. Neither. Crankshaft? <laughs> Crankshaft did it. <laughs> Where's the crank? I, I get it, game. Thank you. Thank you. Crank? I'm going to move away from that because that <laughs> hurts me. Please stop saying that. You I'll find the, it. The, the, the train? I'm going to look at the back first. All right. What if there's something on this side? You're checking out its hot back end. All right. All right. Poirot taught me to look at everything. <laughs> Poirot crank! can't save us now. Right. Where's our cultured Frenchman when we need him? With his tiny little mustache. Turn off. And forward. And back. And off. Hmm. Is there anything else to do in here? Not until you have that crankshaft. But I can't get out now. Look look at the floor. There you go. Oh, thank God. (laughs) It was just like, no, no, I do not want. <laughs> Please let me go. 
Okay, so you have barriers on both sides. Let's go. What's on this? Just that train tracks going down. Yeah. Into a dark alley. I thought those flowers said crank. <laughs> Man, this guy sure loves his drugs. <laughs> is, is that the right terminology they're using? I don't remember. And kids today in their them kids today in their crank all up and down the railroads in their racing cars with the crank. That sounds dirty. That sounds marginally dirty. Oh my god. Where's the crank? I remember when I used to crank it up and down the railways myself. Cut ties, untied, tied. But no blood. <laughs> Thank you for telling me it's rope. Rope. That's very good to know. Rope. Ooh. Huh. Do you think we should get some paper? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. All right, I'll go get some paper. I could always do the um, the nice PlayStation Four trick where you save the photo. <laughs> Yeah, oh no, oh god. But it'd take no. forever to pull oh, it later. Oh, that looks so crappy. Hold on, let's check our share button. <laughs> <laughs> let's take ourselves completely out of this game. Watch, all right. we're overthinking it, and it's like, there's no problems, like, at all that we'll ever have this. So it's capital J, lowercase z, and arrow pointing down in 391 over 393. Damn you, Jay-Z. And your good music. I uh, I want to keep. What's that? What was that? Is that your radio? Go check your radio, please. No, I have the window open in the other room. That's singing. Okay, some good dude. Please drunk. go check it. What's up? That scared me so bad. I thought it was the freaking game. Yeah. No. Yes, I want to touch it. Not, not yet. Come on. You want to touch my crank? See, this is touch, and then it says no. <gasps> what is? You want to touch a dead body? Do you want to see a dead body? Okay. Uh, okay. can you change the angle on that, maybe? See if it... Okay, it's definitely altering itself. Yeah. But I can't move when I touch it. Yeah. That's so weird. Okay. Huh. So the most it ever shows me is when it's at its head. Yeah, it might it might need to find more, and it'll expand the whole. I'm trying to get it at like just the right spot. Yeah, I think you're gonna need to get the whole, get to where it opens up, all of them. Okay. Your radio is haunted, though. I'm just saying. Yeah, but it's not being played. It was some guy drunk outside. Was he singing? Probably. That scared me so bad. Probably. It sounded so, like, non-human. Do not enter. Do not enter where I want to go. Rock. Rock. Oh, somebody picked that up. Oh. I don't know. It's not right, but... That rock killed that man. It's possible. It was an assassin rock. It was like kapow. That rock wanted that man dead. Can you smell what the rock is cooking? It's murder. <laughs> what? I get the total exploration, mm -hmm. but 
I feel like maybe the area should be a little more limited. If that makes sense. Hmm. You just gotta find the Jerry's. The Jerry's know the way. <laughs> the Jerry's are gone so They're gone forever. Oh, my Jerry. I feel like I'm going the totally wrong way. And then... I like this rock. I don't know why I like this rock, but I like it. Can I hug you? No? Oh, okay, I'll leave. Is it just, why is it so dark? Well, on that screen it's not dark, but on my freaking PlayStation it's dark as shit. Hmm. Hmm. Not sure. these dense foliage. Yeah, I think you will stay away from dense foliages. That's that's clearly not the way. You gotta find like the kind of path. The kind of path that's not really a path, but right. Oh, hey, thing. <gasps> Woo! back our jerrys no don't go there okay i feel like i have to follow him yeah but you might not know hmm. i feel like i have to where did he go you see he led you away from the truth and david the covenant <laughs> found him it's like waldo Found you, Waldo! I have Hello Spaceman from David Bowie running through my head. <laughs> Waldo, don't leave us. Oh, this boy. Are you gonna lead us to Jerry? Are you gonna find Jerry? I feel like he's going a really long way. Like, out of his way. I think he's always going to be one step ahead of you. I get that, but I feel like he's slightly misleading. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You charged at him. Where is he? Before it was too late, he's right behind you. Oh Ooh. god, spaceman, where are you? Oh no, go 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 back to that, that thing. A little den there. Oh damn. Where did you go? Spaceman. Fuck. I see the pole. Maybe I have to call him again? No, looks like it's... Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. Shit. I cannot lose him this time. Sorry, this is intense. Up and over. Forward to the left. I just need to look for the flash. Yep. When he pops back. Oh shit, I almost lost him again. Where are you going, spaceman? What are you leading me to? But this isn't where I lost him last time. It was right over here. Where is he going? There he is. Look up! Look up! <laughs> Stop looking at a spaceman! Look up! What the hell? What in the world? 
So, is this a lighthouse from Bioshock 3? Oh. That would be interesting. Like, oh my god. Damn you, Yogg! Damn you! It's either that or you got kidnapped by the doctor. <laughs> he fixed the, the cloaking device and the TARDIS now looks like a freaking tiny UFO. Look at the other windows. I feel like I went the wrong way. Well, yeah, you didn't necessarily look at all the things. Oh, God. What am I... There's another one. And another one. And another one. Another one. Another one. Am I a star? Another one. Another one. Am I another, one. another one. There's so many. Another one. What's happening? I don't know. There's nothing behind me. Look up. Oh, thing. Read. <gasps> Fangs. The beast had fangs, but was heavy and slow. So when it saw the light in the sky, it waited, thinking the light would go out like the others before it. When it did not, the beast rose up on its legs and went to the place where the fire was still burning. As the orange light died, another took its place. This one was blue, a bright and pure blue that the creature had only seen along the edges of the stars. The beast showed its fangs, and the light vanished. A moment later, the light appeared again between two distant trees. The beast wanted to go home, but could not ignore the light, so it chased it deeper into the forest. This is, is like a rabbit room, hole. Travis? Stories, stories, always with the stories. Get out! I read the Fangs one. I liked uh, the beast. At least he gets to leave this goddamn place. Oh, you have a shitty older brother. <laughs> Yep, that's still a beast. It says one of two. Yep. When the light stopped, it did so in a clearing of trees. The beast entered the circle, feeling no fear. The trees turned toward the beast, pointing at it like needles. But the tops of the trees lowered and dug into the ground. The trunks and roots were raised into the air and closed around the beast-like walls. As the ground disappeared, the beast realized it would never use its fangs again. Is that about your brother? I'm you were just in this wooden cottage the whole time. I you and your crazy... I was a star. I was... I was a star! Yeah, you were just doing a pod. Look at that. It's like a... Treehouse. A treehouse, yeah. Oh, it's a rocket ship treehouse. <laughs> Rock... Yay! I hate to say it, but we're going Ooh. on a trip in my favorite rocket ship. <laughs> what about that one? Did you read... No, you read that one. That's that the beast. That the beast. Is that the beast part two? That's the beast part know. one? No, that looks... Oh, that's cruel. Well, who wow. would write... Nobody's used Gaylord since Rotate the it. 90s. Rotate it. Okay, Yellow Hills of Mars by Douglas Spaulding. Plus Julian Wells, Clarence Curtis. Yeah, we're, yeah. Oh. oh. Hold on, let me try that again. There's nothing on there. Nothing at all. Besides disappointment. Yeah, we, we gotta ro rotate things. We gotta rotate. Interesting. Are we in his head? I don't know. All right. Well, we should probably end this one here. Now that we have sufficiently started the game. And have we? Have we? <laughs> don't pull this whole, like, we're in a different time and a different place and maybe we'll never figure it out. I don't know. I don't know either. We'll, we'll be back. We should say goodbye. We, we should say goodbye. So I guess this is goodbye.